earlier on today, so we've known each other for five plus years, worked on a bunch of projects, right? A good conversations and, and things. And I myself, I'm trying to find time to sit down and talk. You're busy today. Yeah. It's very kind. I did a half-hearted puppy dog guilt look to face, right? Like I said, just because I like it. Yeah, yeah. It's like, I got 15 minutes, right? Or not 15 minutes, a half an hour, which is, which is generous because the, the day-to-day is, I find, very busy. Which, and and which it never stops. And so I think taking this half an hour isn't going to make or break any situation that I have. It, it'll be there tomorrow. It was there yesterday. It'll be there when we're done with this. So like, describe a little bit. You come to work. You got a full plate. You're juggling a bunch of stuff. How do you, what's it like? How do you tackle it? Uh, well, unfortunately, you know, you can't, most of the time, I can't work on one project, let's say all day. Definitely not all week. You know, it's not like I have, a, 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 with the exception of RSR, which you know very well took a lot of our time. Most of the days I have a, a, a half a dozen projects that need some sort of touching. Uh, it might just be a phone call or it might actually be some sort of deliverable, or drawings or a report. That's usually the plan, but then within an hour of being here, an email comes, a phone call comes, there's something else that needs addressed, to be addressed, and it's urgent. You know, there's either, either a construction issue and it can't wait, or, um, you know, a, a client, or... Uh, there's always something that comes up in your way, and so, you know, even though you don't put those hours on your schedule, they wind up being there. Uh, and I think that's part of what makes it so busy. How do you... Break it down for me a little bit. So I'm downstairs, the structures group. You're upstairs, the LD group. I'm playing devil's advocate a little bit. But as a percentage of your week, like if you had to chunk your week, is it 99% on the phone communicating? Is it 99% producing drawings? Like if you, had, if you were to talk to a student and just say, this is generally what you're in for at my level. Uh, love communications all together, right? Phone, email. Those are the two big ones. Um, it's probably only about 25% okay. of, of my time is actually communicating. Uh, maybe another 25% helping other engineers, because in my role I do have a lot of other people working on the projects that I'm responsible for, so I need to go to this person's desk and help them through or keep them going, um, or I might have to you know, mark up a drawing or something and get somebody else to keep them busy, that's another piece of what I'm doing is helping keep the staff busy because they don't have jobs of their own. They need project managers to, to give them work. Um, then I guess another 25% would be you know, working on the next job, a proposal or you know, chasing an opportunity uh, or even just reading an RFP uh, or, or reviewing somebody else's proposal. We do a lot of this where we hand each other stuff. Can you just take a look at this for me? You know, um, what's that get me up to? 75%. Or 75%? 75%? I guess I don't really know what I do with the other 25%. Sure. Um, those are really ballpark estimates on time, but if I, if I actually recorded myself throughout the day, it probably would be another several categories yeah. that I would break it down into. 